comes in handy with these boys we love and know. See, there's Carter, Chance, and Jaden. Watch this mommy host the show. It's the Daily Davis and Sean. Yes, the Daily Davis and Sean. Good morning, guys. We, Nova has another appointment this, this morning, and this time we're semi-prepared. We have the the car seat in the diaper bag this time, and we're gonna get free in the stroller. And I have the insurance card, because last time I forgot them. But, I'm still struggling this morning because I thought that her, first of all, I thought her appointment was yesterday. And then I was like, no, I figured out that it was today. But today I thought it was at 11 o'clock, but really it's at 10.15, so we're kinda like rushing to get her there. <laughs> so, um, she, no, she's good. All right, let me, let me go get her in the car and get all warm. Look at her, so peaceful. We're about to disturb her peace and take her in. Peaceful. What? This is the first time being peaceful. I know, in the car seat. Yeah. I told you guys that she can't stay in her car seat. And this is the first time she didn't cry in it. But it's because she's tired. And now we gotta take her out and undress her and she's gonna scream. And we just gotta annoy her. You ready to do all that? She needs to get used to this. This is what life is. This is what life is. It's cold here. What's I can't tell. I don't know why you're... It's 40 degrees. I was up there the whole time. It's been there the whole time. Mm, it's 40 degrees. I feel like it's colder than that though. It does seem colder. I think we're supposed to get a little bit of snow tomorrow. Just a little bit. Alright, we'll keep y'all updated on her appointment. Y'all hear that baby? That's how they cry. She's getting weighed. Okay, so we're back home. I am making myself some breakfast because I didn't eat before we left. Some turkey bacon, my Ezekiel muffins, just in the toaster, and some eggs. And here's homegirl. Hey, mama. These things stay in the way. I can never <laughs> get your face. There we go. Hey, Nova. What are you doing? Hey! Say hey to the people! What you doing, mamas? Hmm? My turkey bacon is popping. Alrighty, food is done. I already took a bite. <laughs> and here's baby girl again. This. <laughs> hey! You wanna tell them you're back on track for weight gain? Yeah, her getting big! Is her getting big? Yes! You're getting a second chin? Yes, you are. <laughs> um, so if y'all if y'all remember from her last appointment, she was a little bit not underweight, but she could have gained like weight more aggressively, I guess. Um, her pediatrician said that her weight was fair, fair weight gain of the last appointment. She was gaining 3.3 ounces a week I think it was but she would have liked to see her gain at least four ounces and now she is doing really good she's gaining in the past since, since going last time she's gained seven ounces a week which is a lot better than what her pediatrician had wanted so she's back on track she's doing good she's almost nine, nine pounds she's eight and a half pounds now so we're really we're the pediatrician and me is really happy about um, her growth so yes she's doing good right girl right hmm anyways I have to I need to get this vlog up and then after that what do I need to do I feel like there's something oh I'm gonna go through the PO box packages that we that we got in I'll show you guys my face is really dry I need to put some like do like a another face facial mask I did one the other day but this this winter is like making my skin so dry but yeah, let me do this and eat and I will talk to you guys shortly. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and do this small haul that we got, small P.O. Box haul. We got three packages in our P.O. Box recently. Um, so we got, first thing we got was from 
Miss Linda, and she sent some items a while back. She sent one of the items that she sent was this this pink teddy bear that I have up on Nova's shelf. So, anyways, she sent her some pacifiers because I I'm pretty sure she I told you guys that she would not take a pacifier, and I was trying to try try different brands, and I have not tried this brand yet, so I'll try this next. The one that I have currently that she sometimes takes, but not really. Like she has to be really, really, really tired to take it and even then she'll still like spit it out. So I'm gonna try these next and we'll see how she takes to these. And then she also sent these pink and gray and white pacifier attachments where you put them onto a shirt and it holds the pacifier. And they're really cute, I love these colors. So thank you Miss Linda for sending sending her these, oh is it upside down? No, no, that's good. <laughs> sending us these, I will let you know how she takes to these pacifiers, fingers crossed that maybe she'll like these ones a lot better. Anyways, the next package we got was from LaToya, and she sent some really thoughtful gifts. They're amazing. First first of all, she sent these gifts for Chance and Jaden, uh, some fitteds. I love these colors. They're so cute. I love them. Um, and it's crazy because I was thinking about getting them some new hats anyways because the ones that they have are like getting a little raggedy. So they're going to love these. And then next, she sent these gifts that I am obsessed with. I love them. It was extremely thoughtful. I just love like personalized and just, I guess, custom thoughtful gifts like this. So she sent this, two hearts, and I'll show you both of them. But first she sent this one um, in memory of my dad. It says, because someone we love is in heaven, there's a little bit of heaven in our home in loving memory of David and Bubba Smith, um, 1964 to 2017. Um, you can see it really close I like this is ugh, just amazing and I'm gonna put this down where on my entertainment center where I have like his picture from another subscriber like she made like a shadow black box thing for him I showed you guys that I'm here before and my little candle I'll show you guys that when uh, once I put this down there this is beautiful and then this one she oh this it says together we make a family and it has like puzzle pieces of all of our names tj mine nova carter Jaden, and chance like all of us isn't this amazing i love this like these little keep keepsakes no no i'm just like obsessed with these so thank you so much for these these are like really really thoughtful and if any of you guys are interested i guess in purchasing things like that i'm assuming she got it from this website because it came in this box personalizationmall.com so in case you guys want to get one of these for yourself all right and then lastly we got some a package from Kamitria, and she, i'm assuming she made these handcrafted there was no letter or anything but i'm assuming, assuming she made these little booties for nova aren't they so cute they're adorable Gosh, i wish i was i was talented like this like i can make stuff like this i can't <laughs> but her does she have a website etsy she has an etsy if you want to check these check her out cam breen's designs 2449 um, or if you look up maybe Kamitria Payne here, how about I just show you guys the card? I won't show the phone number. I don't know if she wants that out. It might be too small to see, but there. Screenshot that if you want to check out her Etsy and get some booties like this made. I'm assuming she has some on there. So thank you guys so much for all of your thoughtful gifts. You guys are amazing. I love all of you guys. And yeah. Oh, let me go put this downstairs and I'll show you guys. Um, where I'm gonna where I'm gonna put it okay so I put it right here next to um this little thing that somebody my a subscriber had made for me and this I believe I bought this one from a subscriber not a subscriber uh somebody on Facebook their business I can't remember what um her business was called but uh yeah if I'm not mistaken so I put that one there and now I gotta figure out where I put this one I have so much stuff. I have to find out, some, find a place for that clock too. Um, let's see. It's getting kind of full up here. This is from a subscriber too. I love this thing. Um, let's see. Should I put it up here? Maybe I'll put it up here. Right there. For now, I think that's fine. For now, and then I got to figure out, figure out a place for that. She's up from her nap. Is Joe sleepy? He's still sleepy. She has the hiccups. 
so crazy because she used to get them all the time in the womb. Girl, we looking alike today, girl. We look alike. We're gonna do a face like you. Your mean look. We look alike twins. What you doing? You about to film? You about to film? Ow. Oops. He's about to film. I thought uh, he got this out. I thought he was getting ready to do this. I guess he's gonna do it later. Is it not long enough or something? What? What you gotta do? What you gotta do? Really? It takes two seconds to clean the windows. How many times I gotta tell you? You are a dad who comes in handy. You ain't know. Mm-hmm. You should do the video now. You could do this with kids around. Yeah. Your video is it's not as harder to do. You got a lot of kids. Mm. Yeah. Anyways, for those who are wondering what this is, it's a fogger sticker. <laughs> 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 I just made that up. It, okay, it's a window film. Um, and what else? With a frost pattern. With a frost pattern. So basically, it frosts, it fogs your window up. Basically, it's a sticker, big old sticker that you put on and it fogs your window. So, like I said, a window fogger. This <laughs> is <laughs> basically what it is. I like a window fogger is something that, that fogs up your window. It does. It looks like fog. Yeah. So that nobody can see inside your windows because you could, like, Literally, like anybody can see into our windows, and it drives me crazy, especially at nighttime. Like when I come downstairs, I'll just run back upstairs real quick. Because I feel like he'll be watching I me through the window. Imagine her running upstairs, cause she does yes, I do. Like <laughs> I would look outside real quick, and then I run upstairs. Cause I don't know who out there. So, anyways, he's gonna do this sometime later on, and I'm getting ready to make um, lunch for myself. Uh, let's see, I'm going to make what it's called. I guess it's called a Buddha bowl. I don't know, I've been seeing them on Instagram. And I guess it's basically just like a protein packed bowl with like vegetables and stuff. So I'm going to do some quinoa, um, sweet potatoes, aspar not asparagus, Brussels sprouts. And what else am I gonna do? Chickpeas, and I think that's it. And maybe some cabbage, so. I'm gonna start that right now. Alrighty, so this is my attempt at a Buddha bowl with, like I said, it's just vegetables and grains, quinoa, cabbage, Brussels sprouts, sweet potatoes, and chickpeas. Yeah, um, but I know you can make them different ways. You can put, you can put black beans in your bowl if you want to. You can do carrots. What else have I seen? Tofu, but I don't have any tofu. Um, what else? Yeah, I'm not sure what else, but that's what I've seen. I'm sure if you hashtag Buddha Bowls on Instagram, then you'll be able to see a bunch of different versions. So anyways, I'm gonna eat while she is knocked out on my chest. <laughs> so we're in Nova's room because we were doing some tummy time. What are you doing tummy time? You wanna show them? She's got really good uh, neck control. She does, she does so good. Let's show them, come on. All right, show them how you can lift your head up so well. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead, Mama. You can do it. There you go. There you go. She'll lift her head up all the way up and like start looking around. Let me fix her hand. A little bit. Uh oh, you spitting out. Alright. Maybe I need to come over here. Look. Where's mama going? Here we go. There you go. Oh, now she's getting frustrated. I should have I should have recorded when it when we were first doing it. Alright, hold on, let me show you. So sometimes when she gets frustrated, I'll I'll do it with her on top of me. And she'll hold her head up really well too. Like this. Yeah, see? 
Good job. Yeah. What are you saying? What are you saying? Huh? What are you saying? Oh. <laughs> Hold on. Looks dark. <laughs> Sorry, it's so dark, y'all. But you can see her. Oh. What are you doing? There you go. <laughs> Good job, Mama. Good job. Yeah. Are you trying to eat now? Girl. <laughs> she is napping again. I am eating some fruit. Right now, it's a little snack. TJ just put my weight rack together. The rest of the weight, weights are in there. That looks good. Um, I can't. I think some people had asked me where I got this from, and I got it from Amazon. And if you search weight rack, I think this will come up. I think that's what I googled. Yeah, I think. Google it. Yeah, Google <laughs> weight rack, and that should come up. But anyways, now he's getting ready to tighten the legs on the chairs because like we told y'all the other day, or he told y'all the other day, they're a little bit wiggly. And we don't want anybody getting hurt in the chairs if they sit in the chairs. He also finished the, what did I call them? F foggy stickers. <laughs> he finished them. I'm so happy. So now people can't just see straight into our house through these windows. And I'll let you guys see the boys real quick before I end the vlog. What's going on in here, y'all? <laughs> Boy. They're in here watching TV. It's almost bedtime, y'all. Anyways, they're not. <laughs> they're ignoring me. And Carter's back here in his chair. You gonna say hey, guys? <laughs> yeah. They're not. Ooh, careful, Chance. Did you break the roof? Paying me any attention. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And we will see you guys in our next one. Love you guys. <laughs>